Hello, my materialistic minions. It's me, Bo Shevasu with Knox Studio. I run a nonprofit film studio and we produce video for other nonprofits. But enough of the shameless sales pitch right there. I'm actually here to review a very, very popular, highly rated uh, set of, well, I don't want to say set because it's a set of 100, which really isn't a set. Look at that. There is a ginormous amount that you get of these little snap clips. And I'm a little incredulous because they have very good ratings. And how can you have such good ratings when you have, you know, basically snap clips here? Which, by the way, I am one of those reviewers that has never, ever paid or compensated in any way for reviews. They're always ethical and they're always, always uh, from my heart. And because I want to just impart this knowledge on you instead of you going out and dropping um, you know, 10, 15 bucks on something like this, and then they end up breaking if you just wiggle it back and forth like this 10 times, which, as you can see, just pulling one straight out, it is not actually breaking. Look at that, it has a little bow on it. That's adorable. This one also has a pattern on this side, and then that side is not. So they actually tend to have little patterns on them. That's rather adorable. Um, so I would say they're just about under two inches um, compared to, let's say, this one I actually got at the store to compare it side by side. And you can tell that you can actually open it up with one hand like this. I have two daughters, Lucy and Penny, so I'm always putting these in their hair. And also finding them around the house. I'm pretty sure that women mark their territory with these things. As opposed to this one that I got at the store, it's much more firm and it takes a little bit more oomph to actually um, open and close it. So uh, if in fact this will stay in place, let's test it on my own imperfect hair right here. So you take it like so, you put it in like this, and you snap it. It's not poking or anything like that. It's staying in place if I were to make myself look like an idiot on social media. And then if we were to pop it out like so, no pointy little pokey ends or anything like that. Um, it's, uh, I would say that if in fact you are gonna buy these things, you can tell it's not the most robust of metals. Uh, as opposed to some of the like multi-tool type hair clips out there. Uh, which, by the way, I heard that there is another little multi-tool hair clip like this with an actual blade on it. Well, it's not really a blade. It sort of looks like a raptor claw so that you can have it in your hair. And you're like, oh no, there's an Amazon box. I don't have any way to slice it open. You just pull it out and go whoop like that and it opens up. But that's a different product. I'm not here to talk about that. Um, but anyway, this little guy right here, yeah, I would say that they would maybe last about, my guess, is a year. Although, if you have a hundred of these things, odds are it's probably going to get lost before you actually break it. And as you can see, I'm really trying to break it right here. Obviously, you wouldn't do this normally, so I'm really trying to break it. And it is not. Is it get, it's getting warm though. <laughs> you could start a fire that way. Well, cool, excellent. So it passes my little uh, speculative test uh, unscientifically. I hope that this is enough for you to determine whether or not these 100 pack of clips is right for you. I'm not gonna go through and count every single one, but by the looks of it, there's about a hundred. I think you're coming out ahead with this deal. They're dirt cheap. Even if you're getting a pack of 50, you're probably still coming out ahead. So that's it. My name's Bo Chevisu. I look forward to testing, reviewing, and demonstrating more fun things here on Amazon.com.